a single input logic gate also has a single output. There are no other inputs to consider. If you are new to this channel, just hit the subscribe button for free. The buffer operator mirrors the output from the input value. Fundamentally, it is an amplifier. A buffer takes a small signal and provides a copy of that one to drive a heavy load. While the pins 7 and 14 of the integrated circuit 7407 are connected to the ground and power supply respectively, the remaining 12 pins are intended for the 6 logic gates that use the buffer operator. This means that the output values of even numbered pins are the same as the input values of odd numbered pins. Therefore, the pins 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, and 12 have the same values of the pins 1, 3, 5, 9, 11, and 13 respectively. The output values of an L298N H-bridge motor driver are amplified signals of the input values. They use four buffer gates. The NOT operator gives an inverted output value that negates the input one. It is also known as an inverter because true becomes false and false becomes true. While the pins 7 and 14 of the integrated circuit 7404 are connected to the ground and power supply respectively, the remaining 12 pins are intended for the 6 logic gates that use the NOT operator. This means that the output values of even numbered pins are negated input values of odd numbered pins. Therefore, the output values of pins 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, and 12 are the inverted or opposite values of the input pins 1, 3, 5, 9, 11, and 13 respectively. When the playing mechanism of an audio tape recorder is engaged, the ribbon of a cassette tape either rolls to the left or to the right. The preset mode of the tape recorder only activates one of two sets of rotating parts. In backward mode, when the ribbon is rolling to the left, the erase head on the right side of the record of playhead exists. The front side of the record or playhead for recording or playing the back side of a cassette tape will be used. The cup stand spins clockwise. So in unison, the pinch roller spins in the opposite direction, counterclockwise. The take-up reel is on the left side of the audio tape recorder. It is spinning clockwise. In contrast, during forward playback, where the ribbon rolls to the right, the erase head is on the left side of the record or playhead. This time, the back side of the record or playhead will be used for recording or playing the front side of a cassette tape. 
The capstan now spins counterclockwise on the right side. In unison, the pinch roller spins clockwise. The capstan and pinch roller are working in conjunction. They go hand in hand. The take up reel is on the right side of the audio tape recorder and it is spinning counterclockwise. If the buffer gate amplifies the electric signal, the NOT gate inverts the value between true and false. In this example, we demonstrate how can a vinyl record be played backward on a long player at 33 and one-third revolutions per minute. During normal playback, the long player spins the vinyl record clockwise, but when you engage its reverse mode, it would spin counterclockwise. This is what disc jockeys are using to play a back mask version of the original recording. I hope you enjoyed watching this informative video about basic circuits.